Harrison Page called you today. There's a message on the table. Thank you, Miss Ellie. I know. I spoke to him before dinner. What did he want? He was returning my call, actually. I didn't go into work again today, and I wanted to explain. I'm going to take a little time off. Well, where did you go? To the cemetery. With Cliff. Great, you are. Yeah. Feeling better, Sue Ellen? Much. Sue Ellen, would you like Teresa to fix you something? You hardly ate anything at dinner. Uh, thank you, Miss Ellie. I'm uh, really not very hungry. I think she gets all the nourishment she needs from this. Uh, just club soup. Anyone care for a sip to uh, prove that I'm not lying? Sue Ellen, don't. That's not necessary. Well, I think everybody's curious as to what you had to drink before we came into the room, honey. Let it go, J.R. Huh? I said let it go. You're not going to accomplish anything like this. Well, probably the first step in curing a drunk is getting them to admit what they are. I'm just trying to help Sue Ellen by getting her to admit what she is, an alcoholic. Why should she? Are you willing to admit what you are? Well, Lucy, why don't you stay out of this? This is between Sue Ellen and myself. Not when you attack her in front of the whole family. That makes it our business. Bobby, you got enough trouble handling your own wife. Why don't you leave mine to me? Don't even start, J.R. Well, everybody can see that she's cracking up, slowly and surely, and who can blame her? I mean, she finds out that her daddy, Digger Barnes, is no relation at all. And her real father is a saddle tramp and a thief, and, and her mother's a whore. And I, who could find it in their heart to hate that poor little girl, huh? Could you? Oh! Now you knock it off! Both of you! You watch that temper of yours, Bobby. And you, JR, watch that mouth of yours. Ah. Little club soda, darling. Looks like you might need it. 